Hey YouTube, Drone Tech here. Here we go again. It seems Chris Cuomo has reset to factory defaults and is sounding a lot more like what we're used to. Yesterday on CNN during Chris Cuomo's show, he, Van Jones, and Rick Santorum were all discussing the shutdown and money for the border wall. Santorum rightly asked the two if they support Nancy Pelosi and Chuck Schumer saying that Trump won't get a single dollar for the wall. And this is recent history, so I was completely baffled when I heard Chris Cuomo deny that this is Pelosi and Chuck Schumer's position. It is true that at one time Pelosi said that she would give a dollar for the wall, one dollar, but are they really being that literal? And also, watch how Van Jones takes Chris Cuomo's lead after he makes his denial. You support, you support Nancy Pelosi and Chuck Schumer saying the president isn't going to get a single dollar for any new wall. You that's support that, saying. and you think that's, hey, that's a reasonable that's, negotiating that's not what they're position. Saying. That's not what they're saying. The, the, listen, they are saying. The president isn't going to get a single dollar for any new wall. You that's support that, saying. and you that, think that's hey, a reasonable that's, negotiation. That's not what they're position. saying. That's not what they're saying. The, the, listen, they are host, saying. Hostage not what they're saying. Hostage not what they're saying. Hostage not what they're saying. That Speaker Pelosi had said uh, she would, didn't want to give even more than one dollar to the border wall. In a situation in which you would accept even a dollar of wall funding for this president in order to reopen the government. A dollar? It will never pass the Senate. Not today, not next week, not next year. If you want to open the government, you must abandon the wall. We're anyway. not doing a wall. Does anybody have any doubt that we're not doing a wall? So that's it. Are you worried about backlash? Are you worried Thank about you. backlash? No, it has so nothing to do with it. politics. It has to do with the wall is an immorality between countries. Like I said, this is recent history, so it should be fresh in everyone's memory. Even Chris Cuomo has been out there cheering Nancy Pelosi on her refusal to fund the border wall. About the name that we came up and it was Nancy. You came up with it. In fairness, Nancho. my yeah. name was not good. I had Palumer and Shalosi. And you were like, oh. <laughs> Man, Chuck is great because it's like what Bruce Lee would do with those things. What happened in that room? I say that today because as I was laying, you know, taking the Theraflu day, nighttime this morning, as I was laying in bed and uh, this afternoon, and I saw this on television, and just objectively speaking, I was like, oh my gosh, Nancy Pelosi is a boss. Mm. I mean, she handled herself amazingly. Well, it's amazing what a few weeks, weeks difference can make. You know what I mean? Like yeah. she had all those people bringing the hate parade on her about whether or not she should be speaker. When I interviewed her the day after the election, she was like, I'm going to be speaker. Yeah. It's pretty damning to Chris Cuomo when you have Pelosi outright saying, quote, we're not doing the wall. Does anybody have any doubt about we are not doing a wall? So that's that. It has nothing to do with politics. Uh-huh. Right. It has to do with the wall and its immorality between qu countries. It's an old way of doing things. And Chuck Schumer saying, quote, you are not getting the wall today, next week, or January the 3rd when Democrats take control of the House. Well, where's the fact checker at CNN? This is the kind of thing CNN and the rest of the media get away with on a daily basis. Nobody can police everything they say, but you can find at least one example of this kind of thing every single day. Hey, everybody. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe.